We've been much warmer than average this week, a trend that will continue into the weekend, but a big change that's on its way for next week. I'm UF forecaster Grayson Jarvis with the three big things you need to know going into the rest of your Wednesday. Of course, I just mentioned the warmer temperatures as a result of high pressure that settled into the region. Remember, that will stay in place through the weekend, but after that, a strong cold front will begin moving through the area next week that could drop us down to more temperate conditions for this time of year. Now, before we get to that, we are going to be getting a little bit of the break from the heat we saw today with a weak cold front that moves through tomorrow. Now we're only going to be dropping about two degrees. We saw a high of 80 today and only a high of 78 tomorrow, but still it's a little bit of a break from that kind of heat. We have a thick cloud cover expected for tomorrow, so it might feel a little cooler throughout the region ahead of the cold front that we can expect for next week. Now that's really going to start settling in Monday night as this much warmer air from the southwest begins to shift below us and we can start seeing this trough and ridge develop on Monday evening, that's when we're going to start seeing temperatures slowly drop ahead of the cold front moving through on Tuesday. We're going to be really feeling that temperature drop on Wednesday. Six day forecast going into the rest of the week. For the most part, we're going to be relatively stable throughout the region going into Tuesday. But again, remember, as that cold front moves through, we are going to be dropping in temperatures on Wednesday.